Hey guys, for my next wedding talk video, I wanted to talk about my um, organizing of my wedding details and receipts and things like that. And this is the binder that I use. Um, I bought it from Target and I decorated it with these little, they're stickers and you just stick them on and I just slid my hands in and stuck them all into the binder just because I want to make it cute. Um, in this binder, I hold everything for the wedding. I have receipts and ideas, information, everything you can think of for the wedding is in here. And I think it's really important to keep yourself organized, especially when you're planning a wedding because you don't want to miss anything. If you do, you're going to stress out. And my biggest thing is not stressing out. Danny and I are both in college and we work and we volunteer at church and we have our own social lives and we have so much going on that I try my very best to keep things organized and in order and things going exactly planned out and everything so that this is smooth and we can enjoy this planning process rather than running around trying to figure out what needs to be done and what um, we forgot and what you know we still have to f do or figure out and we um, I found that this is really really helpful so I'm gonna go over what I have in this binder how I did it and why I love it so much um, I have eight categories in the binder and they are separated by these tabs on the side and my first category is just named important and in that category I have information for the wedding I have contacts for all of our um, our wedding party I have just little notes that I'll leave myself to remind myself things or things that Danny and I feel are important to us so I just put everything in important if it's important to me basically um, in the second category we have budget and the budget has the money breakdowns, what we want to spend in each aspect of the wedding, um, the wedding budget that Danny made, which we also have on an Excel spreadsheet. And it's basically just a way for me to look and to see what we have to spend on certain parts of the wedding, what we have spent, what um, we've saved on, what we haven't spent. So I like to look at that just so I can see and keep my, like myself in perspective so I don't go crazy because it's really easy to just go nuts with spending for a wedding because there's so many things and there's things that you don't even think about and it gets really easy to spend a lot. Our third um, category is for the ceremony and there's information for the ceremony, there's the receipt for the church, um, we have to pay for our church so there's different payments that we have to make and there's just like ideas that I put in there for what I want the ceremony to be like and what um, time it's at and all that kind of information is all just put into there. The fourth tab is for the reception and the menu is in there, what we're having for our cocktail hour. Everything um, is printed out. I printed out the menu that we chose personally and um, what we want to do for the bar and just all of that and the prices and stuff for the reception and what we still owe and when we have to pay it so that that's taken care of at the right time. Um, we have the receipts and everything in there so in case something goes wrong we have it and we have it documented so we can show people if there's a misunderstanding. Our fifth category is the guests and in there we have our save the dates, um, the receipts, we have the guest list which we have printed and I also have it on my laptop. We have all the addresses, we have all the phone numbers, everything that we need about the guests is in there so that if I need to contact someone or if I need to follow up with them when we send our invitations, I have it right there. And if something went wrong with my laptop, I have it right in the binder so I don't have to worry about um, like getting my laptop fixed right away or anything like that. The sixth category is attire, and this I'm going to put all the measurements for the groomsmen and um, prices, and I also have the receipt for my gown and my headpiece, which I bought, and it's a headband. So I have all those receipts, I have my measurements, I have the, the paper about my dress and all of that fun stuff. So that one's not filled yet really, but soon enough it will be. Um, we also have a photography tab, and that is all the information about a photographer, um, ideas I might find and print out, we have our receipt, what we owe, and we also have um, dates because she wants to do an engagement photo shoot to get to know us and to get to 
um, see what we're like in camera, compare our sizes, compare our skin tones, and figure out the best way to photograph us together so that on the wedding day everything runs smoothly. And the last tab that we have is miscellaneous. And in there we have subcategories for the honeymoon, for the rehearsal dinner, and just miscellaneous things. So I have swatches and I have receipts from things I bought because we're doing a candy bar, so I've bought some apothecary jars and I keep all our receipts in there and write exactly what it is and that's all in the miscellaneous. For the honeymoon, we have a magazine for our honeymoon, we have um, information, we have our flight information, we have our travel agent's information, we have exactly where we're going, the hotel, how much we paid, how much is due, and again, if Danny mostly is planning the honeymoon, so he can just go right into the binder and figure it out. This seriously is our Bible for our wedding, and we have everything set up. Um, I have checklists, so for our registry when we did it, we had a checklist, and we took it with us, and we checked everything off that we decided we wanted and needed for our registry and we have a rehearsal dinner planning checklist we have a honeymoon planning checklist and everything has a checklist so that we can figure things out and things can be done correctly I also have the wedding planning checklist in here I honestly think that having a wedding um, binder and organizer is extremely smart um, it keeps everything in perspective it keeps things organized which I really need because if you're busy and you don't have time to scrounge around for things and rush around for things it's really good to be able to just say it's in the binder we can go and check back or if something happens with prices or um, you know your charge double you can go back and say look I already paid for this or this is how much was told I was told that it would cost and you can just check because Danny and I have gotten a lot of good deals because we're having a winter wedding so in case something happens where we were charged the actual price before we got a discount for having a winter wedding we have it all in print and we have it all organized and set up I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope it helped if you need any more um, information on the binder just let me know but again I made it myself um, everything was done by hand I didn't buy anything like an organizer really I just wanted to do it myself because I had different priorities that were more important to me. So if you have any more questions, just let me know and thank you for watching.